Hey guys, it's Sani, and today I have for you a um, Crumble Co. haul. Um, it's a really small one. Um, it's only got three items in it. Um, so like I said, it's not very big, but it's a few things. I'm going to start off by showing you guys the couple waxes I got, and then I'll talk about some other stuff too. Alright, the first one is called Brandon's Orange Soda Struggles. And the scent description is orange, grapefruit, lemon zest, and bubbly vanilla. And it looks like this. And it smells so good. Like, so good. It smells, because it's of the bubbly vanilla, it has a little bit of a creamsicle scent, but it smells so much like cream soda, or not cream soda, I'm sorry, orange soda. Has a little bit of a creamsicle vibe because of the vanilla. But for this scent, um, the orange soda scent and the Mountain Dew scent that he has, I don't know what he puts in it or how he does it, but it has like the, you can smell like the fizz, like the carbonation. You can smell the fizz and I don't know how he does it, but it smells really good. The Dr. Pepper scented one doesn't really have I don't, it doesn't have like the fizz smell that like, like the orange soda one does, but it still smells good. Oh, this one smells so good. On cold sniff, like, cause I gotta see how it melts and how well it melts, but on cold sniff alone, I can see this one being a repurchase and also becoming like a, like maybe in like my top 10, top five kind of favorites. It smells really good. The next wax bar I got is called Carrot Cupcake. And it is described as being a carrot, clove, cinnamon, maple sugar, um, nutmeg, and cake. And it looks like this. With a cute little carrot sprinkle. Mm, and it smells really good. It smells like carrot, like carrot cake. Like if you've ever had carrot cake, it, it smells like carrot cake. Oh, it smells really, really good. You can really smell like the clove and the cinnamon and the nutmeg. You can really smell like the spices and it's a very nice warm scent. So like this is definitely one that is more suit suited and suitable for like fall. So obviously, I mean, I don't melt these right away when I get them anyway. I usually keep them for a little bit. So, but this one's definitely going to be, um, I'm going to wait till fall obviously to melt this one, but it is so, it smells really good. This again, on cold sniff, I could see myself repurchasing this one um, if it melts well. Now the last thing in my haul, um, I'm actually really, really excited about because it is a brand new product. I bought it on launch day. Um, I do still think he has some in stock. If you guys are interested, um, or if you're interested in any of the things you've seen um, or you just want to check him out, go to crumbleco.com. Amazing. But this is the Long Day Shampoo. So this, like I said, he just launched it. I do think he still has some in stock. I got mine in the scent Fruity Loopers because it is my favorite scent that he makes. It just smells just like Fruit Loops. I've had the wax, which is good. Um, I've had the um, body, I've had the aroma spray, which is the, I did a review on that, um, which you can watch, but it's in a, it's called the Crumble To Go Aroma Spray and you can spray it on dang near anything. You can spray it on your clothes, you can spray it on yourself, you can spray it just in the air to like freshen it up, um, furniture, you know, things like that. So, and I've had the Fruity Loopers scent of that as well, and it's just phenomenal. But, so. Uh, and this also does not disappoint. It smells like Fruit Loops. I also smell something else in there, like maybe like, like it smells like the Fruit, the fruit Loop um, scent, but also smells like um, a little bit more lemony, like maybe maybe one of the other ingredients has like a natural lemon scent or something. Um, but I cannot wait to use this. I actually, I just got this today 
not too long ago and actually I need to shower anyway so I'm thinking here soon I may just go ahead and pop this in my shower and try it out today and as always there will be a review of this up um, after I've given it a go and I've used it a couple times like I'm, I'm assuming once I get to about halfway done with it I will um, do a review and let you guys know um, so yeah I'm really excited to try it I hope it's good I would have he did not have a matching conditioner in the Fruit Loop scent um, he does have conditioner though he launched um, the shampoo a conditioner and a hair mask all at the same time but the only thing he had in the Fruit Loop scent was the shampoo. He did not have a conditioner or a hair mask in the Fruit Loop scent um, yet. I do hope he has those in the future. I use, I'm really bad at using conditioner, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I never remember to use it. So, but if he made a Fruit Loop scented conditioner, I would buy it to go with the shampoo and I would actually, I think I would actually use it because I love how it smells, so. There will be a review on this and uh, yeah so yeah I'm I don't want to say I'm mad or disappointed or upset because I'm not because to say that like with everything that's going on to say that like I'm mad or whatever would be weird but I was supposed to get another package of Crumble Co stuff yesterday so but I don't have it yet but it happens and when I get it I'll just film another video because I was gonna film it all together so but so there will so just be on but be a little, little, little. basically what I'm saying is be on the lookout because I will have another video another crumble co haul in and the next couple of days or a week or something because usually I just film um, a bunch of videos and then I like upload them so all right, be on the lookout for that. I also have some more wax reviews on the way and a Sephora haul. So be on the lookout for that. Um, yeah, I'll talk to everyone later. And I guess have a great day and I hope everyone is staying safe and staying inside. Um, or if you are essential and you're still working, I hope you are just being safe. And you know, just I hope everyone's doing good. All right. Catch you later. Bye.